Hello, my lovelies. Hi, everyone. Hope you guys are having a great time. Um, and I hope all is well. And so I just wanted to do this quick show and tell. Um, this unboxing is by Vivica A. Fox. And it's her pure stretch cap. It says all day comfort. Um, I have this wig in the style Skylar, which I think is a beautiful name. So if there's any Skylars out there, that is a gorgeous name. I just have to say that. So <laughs> the color is in 1B and it says that this unit can be heat safe up to, or should I say this unit can be heated. <laughs> okay, this unit can be heated up from 356 to 392. Can you guys tell I had way too much wine? Like seriously, way too much wine. Anyways. So it's a stretch elastic all over um, cover. So I don't know what that means. Maybe in the cap size or whatever, it's like stretchy, but we'll find out, won't we? So um, this um, actual brand, they don't actually show what the actual unit looks like because the model is not wearing the wig. So anyways, um, this is the style and the actual um, color that I have her in. So I'm going to go ahead and take her out so we could unbox together. Don't you go anywhere. I'll be right back. <laughs> well, all right then. So this is Skylar. Skylar is very, very long. I didn't actually see the length on the um, stock card, but if I um, find it, I will link it down below. I will also link down below where you can actually find this wig. But this is one of those wigs that every girl should have in their actual collection because you could never go wrong with this Angelina Jolie look right here, okay? I know y'all seen that movie, Salt. Anyways, so um, there's no sheen to this. I'm under my lighting, so it's making it seem shiny, but it's really not. So if you buy this wig and you feel like it is too shiny, which I doubt, um, you can always tone it down with um, dry shampoo or... Um, baby powder so that is the actual finish on top bangs in the front very long unit no tangling right now and no shedding as far as the cap it did say full cap so i'm assuming no combs as usual so um you do get your adjustable straps no combs in the back in the front of the wig no combs um and like side, you get uh, side tabs or whatever, or ear tabs, I should say, um, to um, put her in um, the correct spot. So anyways, um, let me go ahead and cut this tag off and I will let you know if she is actually big head friendly. So this is her just pulled on my head. <laughs> I just lost my earring. <laughs> Swear to God, my earring, you have no manners. None, none whatsoever. Let's try this again. So, this is one side. The air tabs are lined up. This is the other side. Now, I don't know if I like this part of the wig. But, anyway, so here's the rest of the hairline. I have a big forehead. I just realized that. God. Alright, anyways. So, I'm getting hair in my mouth. All right, so this is Miss Skyler. So I'm gonna bring all the hair to the front. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my earring again, watch. <laughs> so my new subbies, ladies, I am 5'11". I'm gonna actually bring this camera down so you can see where this unit hits me. All right, so let me back up. So this is where this unit hits me right now. All right, folks, sorry about that. So yes, this is where this unit hits me. <clears throat> and I am 5'11", so this hair has to be way longer than 22 inches because I just did a unit that looks similar and that one was like 22 inches and it was much shorter. So um, this is the top of the wig. And let me bring all the hair to the back. Okay, so this is all the hair to the back. 
So it is like below and near my butt. All right, so let me go ahead and lift the back of the unit so you can see that. So this is the back. And all the hair to the front again. This is like, I feel like the lady from Adam's family. <laughs> this is the right side. And this is the left side. So let's just brush this baby out. I'm going to add a little bit of powder right here. Not that it makes a difference. These bangs are so long, but the texture of the hair is very, very soft. And um, it kind of feels like a slight yakky um, touch. I'm not getting any shedding right now and I'm using a wide paddle brush. All right, let me brush the bangs so you could see how long these are. So you definitely gonna have to cut these bangs. I'm gonna actually do that um, right now. And then I'll add a little powder to the top of the wig. I can't see. <laughs> All right, my queen. So remember what I taught you. You figure out where you want to cut your bangs at. Okay. You turn it the other way. Grab it with the other hand. So now you're going to trim all the way across. And all the hair should just lay all uniform together. All right. So there you go. So what I did, I actually put a bag, like a plastic bag here to um, trim the hair because nobody likes to help me clean up the hair once I do my cutting on um, camera. So yeah, so now um, what I'm going to do is add a little powder on the top and I'll be back to show you what she looks like. <laughs> so I'm just adding a little powder right in that little section right there. So I don't know if it makes a difference. All right, my beautiful queen. So what do you think? This unit can actually be taken straight out of the package and just pulled on your head and go. That's what I like. I like the length on this also. This is like one of those go-to wigs. Um, you can always wear it like this. You can pull um, the wig back a little bit off your face if it's too much hair. Um, I'm going to put it behind my ear. And I did change earrings because the other ones, for some reason, they wouldn't stay in. Let me know what you ladies think about this uh, unit. But it's one of those go-to wigs. You know, you grab it, throw it on, and you're out the door. Um, this can be worn to the gym, on a date, to the movies, girls' night. Let's see how it looks all pulled back. You guys know I really hate styling wigs on camera. Um, I have no hair ties. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm panicking at my queen. So this is her pulled back. Gorgeous. And she feels so soft and manageable. Do I look sophisticated? Let me stop. Let me try to style it another way. <laughs> Actually pull her to the side. I didn't brush the back of it down all the way so it was sticking up. But yeah, you can actually wear her to the side like this. Or you could put one huge braid 
either straight back or just braid it to the side and then put your hair ties on the end so it doesn't um the knot doesn't come loose but this is just one of those got to have go to wig every girl should and she does come in other colors so i will definitely link where you can actually find this wig down below and um, you can check out her website and check out all the other colors that this unit comes in but if i was to get another color in this i think i would go with the 99j because it's not too bright and you can actually wear that to work and it still looks somewhat professional because you know it's like a nice dark plummy um, type color i don't know how to explain it but it's not bright red so anyways this is by vivica a fox and it's her pure stretch cap and yes she is very big head friendly okay <laughs> let me not uh, leave that out and this is in the style skylar and the color is 1b and like I said, she is heat safe from 356 to 392. So I'm going to go ahead and link down below where you can find her. If you do, and you do uh, buy this in another color, uh, my email address is down below. Please feel free to send me a picture. Um, don't, you know, don't be shy. And whatever you send me stays between us. So don't think it's going to be all posted up everywhere. So yeah, this is Skylar and she is gorgeous okay so let me know what you ladies think about this wig and as always thank you so much for taking the time to watch my video if you haven't already subscribed hit that subscribe button give me a thumbs up for this one and don't forget to like and share all right ladies so until my next unboxing i just want you to know that I do love you. Stay fabulous. Keep a clean heart and do the right thing, okay? And I love you ladies. <laughs> One love. Mwah. <laughs>